RPG Maker tip number 15. In the last tip video, I showed you how to add your launch DLC plugins to your project. In this video, I want to show off one of the menu plugins. First, click the puzzle icon in the hotbar here. If you haven't added any plugins yet, this will be blank. Just double click an empty space. When this menu comes up, click name, go to launch and double click alt menu screen to MZ. Make sure the status of this plugin is set to on. Go ahead and just click OK for now. Now, when you play test your game, your menu will go from looking like this to this, which I think is much more visually appealing. You can see right in the middle here, right underneath the cursor, there's an arrow for more options. And when you go down, there's another row. That is an option that you can add in the plugin settings. Let's check those out. In the plugin settings, you can adjust things such as how many rows of commands there are and how many columns, whether you want to display character status. There's all kinds of stuff to look through in here to adjust for the menu. Enjoy. 